tune to this. Use the same exact fingers that I use. Uh, basically the intro is A minor. C, 10. G, 9. And um, B, 10. I mean, that is an A minor triad. Oh. Shut up. Now you take this, and you slide it like this to where you've got, it's diminished basically. So this is now the 10 on the G. These two, B and D, 12. And the picking is basically from the A to E. Down, 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 up, 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 down, 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 up, 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 down, 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 up, 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 down, 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 up, 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 up. So you've got. Take this shape. And you don't even change the, the interval in between. It's still a full step. Drop back to where these two are on the ninth fret. And your pointy finger is at the seventh. Got a wang bar? Wee! You do it again and you pinch harmonic it. Now we go into the Gary Moore staple. The first staple is here at the, uh, um, what is that? Three, two, three, on the D. I don't know, you just put on a bunch of gain and you go for it. Now here come the other Gary Moore staples. Um, you got this one here. It's basically an A minor thing in this staple. So on the G string you've got, got five. I guess we'll start here. D, you've got seven, five. And on the G, you've got uh, five, nine. What is that, four each? So look, I'll just give you what they are. First one here. And then you got one here at the, uh, ooh, the D is gonna be seven, nine. And you got uh, seven, nine here, seven, 10 here. Now, there's a bunch of different ways to finger this. You can use these, these, this combination of fingers. I would use, I would try to, to, to this is just my advice, you don't have to take it. I would try to not use this one at all because you, I'd use that. I'd use one and two on that, and one and four, because all the rest are, are this particular. So you got. You know that one, it's four, five, and four and seven. Start back up here again. Then you got. And that's two, three, uh, two, five. Back to the four, five, four, seven. Now you come here to one, one, two, one, four. So you land on this A. Nice and slow, I'll try it. Something like that. I'll try it with juice. If it sounds shit, I apologize, like I just learned this yesterday. Uh -huh. 
Now we do the whole thing at an octave higher. So that shape, which is B, 810 on the B, and um, what is that, 812. Then you've got uh, B is gonna be um, 10, 12, and then high E is 10, 13. Next one is B, 7, 8 to 7, 10. Back to the starting point. Which is, B is 5, 6, uh, 5, 8. Two frets up from there. Uh, four, five, four, seven. A. Um, I can try it with some juice. Finish part in D. Whatever. <laughs> I just want to get through this now. Uh, it's D, or even start there at the third fret D string. You got one and four on the, and it's basically mute. You can pick every note if you want. Then you got that kind of thing. Seven, four, and then six, zero. Down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up. Put your first finger where your pinky was. I don't know how high or low it goes, but this is, it's in this. Maybe switch here to these fingers. And then that big thing is here. It is an F diminished from here. So look at the shape. It's the same shape across all the strings. But we're gonna ace freely it. So you go six notes, that's it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Down, up, down, up, down, up. Three, four, one, four, A, two, four on the, uh, got it? The only time it gets weird is here. Because it's a, uh, you got your B and G tuning madness. And then you got picking, alternate picking starting on a downstroke, which means it's all outside picking. So you got your little, you know, take the highest fret you can, bend up to an E. We're gonna start our A major accidentals, which is, uh, I think it means you're outlining an A major, but you're hitting like that kind of thing. Randy Rhodes did it. I think that's what it means. I could be wrong. 17. Uh, picking's easy. Down, up, down, up. 12. High E. Um, 9 and 8. B string. 10, 9. Back to 9, 8 on the G. Um, uh, G is gonna be uh, 6, 5. Uh, the next two strings are 7, 6. Um, what is that? A, uh, 4, 3. And now you've got a different pattern. You got that, which is still, I believe, accidentals. But you're starting on the root drop down. And uh, just follow me. So we got low E, 5. A, 4. 
seven, D seven, uh, G six, uh, B five, high E, um, five, uh, eight and seven, or I'm sorry, uh, nine and seven, uh, 12, and I believe you got your little diminished. So think of like a D7 here, but bring it up two frets. And then you've got uh, A major here. I'll pick it really slow once. Now here's what you do on this part when you're going up, you uh, pinch harmonic the first note. So one note, and it's like uh, pull off and have hammered back on. And he does it fast as shit. <laughs> I haven't learned how to do this fast, so I'm just gonna do it medium to slow. Thank <laughs> you. 